A warm homecoming today for a teen from Heber City who was hit by a car in a crosswalk in late September. His specialist Lindsay Ertz was there the moment the 14 year old freshman pulled in from the hospital. And Lindsay, tell us what this moment was like. I can imagine just incredible. Oh, Mike, so sweet to see her family, her friends, uh, her cheer team gathered around 14-year-old Ava Saunders. Uh, she came home today right up this road. She lives here behind me. You can see some of the signage of her friends welcoming her home. Even before they got here, her friends were emotional. Now, Ava was welcomed home by a police escort from several agencies, including Park City Police. Now, this all started because Ava was hit by a car back on September 27th as she tried to cross Main Street in Heber. She was in the ICU until mid-October. She suffered a broken pelvis, a right leg femur fracture. She also had a traumatic brain injury. Her mom tells me the doctors didn't expect her to make the progress she has. Now she's walking with the help of a walker. And we spoke to her parents about how Ava's a zest for cheerleading, how she can't wait to get back to the Wasatch High School cheerleading team. You know, she loves cheer, and so she will be two feet on the ground for 12 months until doctors clear her. So this, that is going to be the hardest part of the journey for her. She already wants to get right back to flipping yeah. and twisting yeah. and doing all the stuff with her cheer girls, and uh, we're going to need all their help to, uh, to make sure we keep her safe. Let's go, Ava! As you can see there, lots of enthusiasm from the cheer team. The school's principal and two assistant principals also came to greet Ava, gave her gifts. Many neighbors came out as well. Now, Ava's parents say there's still physical therapy, speech therapy, and lots of healing. But, guys, Ava really happy to be home. And her parents add that the love and support from the community has been amazing as well. Just a happy ending here to a terrible accident in Heber. Reporting live, Lindsay Ertz, KSL 5 News. Lindsay, great story. Thank you. KSL is committed to keeping you and your kids safe on the road. We recently launched our Stop for Students campaign. For more information and in-depth coverage and ways to get involved here, just scan that QR code on the screen or you can visit our website, ksltv.com. You can also order free bumper stickers to remind our neighbors to drive safe.